I'm just, I, I'm really happy because it feels like, unfortunately, there was just this long period of like intermittent breaks and stuff, which I didn't want to take. It was just such a nightmare for like a long time. Like, I am so excited now. I feel like, I feel like I've really been able with this new outfit and with like the renewed sort of attention on Luxium and everything. I feel like we've been given like a brand new chance to like, a, like sort of like a fresh start. And I'm so excited to like put my best foot forward and to just keep trying my very best and make the best content I possibly can. I want to continue to be like, I want to continue to be an entertainer who is like, you know, very satisfying for people who feel underrepresented in entertainment. Like I've, I've gone on many rants before about like how sort of feminine feminine attraction whether it's experienced by women or, or or homosexual men or anyone anyone who experiences attraction to men how their interests tend to be sort of mocked by the mainstream i want to continue to be someone for that i want to make people flustered i want to make people laugh i want to just this is this is just who i am this is who i am and this is the kind of content that i love to make and i know that like it's not for everyone and it will always be not for everyone. That's just something that I have to accept. And I think that for a while it was really, really difficult for me because for the longest time, I think that I experienced this great sense of like self-doubt. You know, did I go in the wrong direction with that? You know, whenever you read someone say, God, I hate these fan service YouTubers, these horny bait YouTubers, everything like that. I, it, it, it kind of stinks, you know, and you sort of think, did I make the wrong choice? Should I have been more approachable? And then I think about, like, just this group that we have and the attention that I receive and the love that I receive from all of you, and I just think, no, I, I think I've done the right thing. So no matter which direction it goes in, I just want to keep being myself. I want to keep doing the kind of things that make me happy. I want to keep doing the kind of things that make you happy, whether it's whether it's like get, whether it's playing games together and being soft and cozy, whether it's chatting and getting to listen to what you think, whether it's uh, whether it's making ASMR that's either helps you sleep or helps you get off. I don't I, I I don't care. This is who I am and this is what I have so much fun with and I know that you love it and that's that's all it really needs to be. And I'm so happy that now in addition to this whole streaming racket, which uh, is still, even though I've been doing it for a year, still feels somewhat new to me. I'm the whole, you know, extracurricular project uh, timetable is back on track. And I feel like every day I'm going to get a chance to look over and work on something that's really genuinely and deeply creative. And because I can't tell you how motivated I felt when um, I was working on the final steps of this of that first law project that you saw yesterday and uh, the teaser for that new one. So